Hey guys, this is Sam, and today I'm going to be showing you how to set any image that you want as the background on your Xbox One. So all you guys need to do this is number one a computer and number two a USB flash drive. Once you've got a hold of those two things, it's as easy as going on your computer, downloading an image from the internet, and then dragging that over to your USB flash drive. Just keep in mind, the image does have to be under three megabytes. If it's over three megabytes, your Xbox One just won't let you use it. Of course, you can do this on both a Mac and a PC, but since all I have in my house is a Mac, I'm gonna be using that. And once I found the image that I wanna use on my Xbox, just go ahead and drag that over to your USB flash drive let it copy and then eject it from your computer. Now I'm gonna to talk to you guys on the Xbox One. After you've turned on your Xbox One, go ahead and plug in the USB that we were just using a second ago into any one of the USB ports on your Xbox One. I just used the one on the left side because that is by far the easiest to access of the two or three that it gives you in total. And once you've gotten this far, an immediate notification will pop up letting you know that A, you either need to download Media Player or if you have it installed already, it'll shoot you right over to where we need to go to view the files on our USB device. So after you've installed Media Player, go ahead and go to this area where it will let you select all the devices on your Wi-Fi or the ones that are plugged in. My USB is called iUSB just for the purpose of this video and you want to click on the USB drive that you just plugged in with the A of course on the Xbox controller. If you have a ton of media on this device, you'll have to scroll through quite some time to find the image that you want to set as your background, but for the purpose of this video I've only got one image on here so go ahead, navigate down to that, tap or click on A on your controller and it will shoot that image right into full screen mode. Now just click on the three line button to the right on your Xbox One controller. I would like to call it the menu button. Go down to and then click A on set as background. And just like that guys, this image has been set as the brand new background for my Xbox One. And you can see that this image in particular, it's actually one of Apple's default wallpapers, looks really nice. And this will be saved no matter what. It's kind of translucent depending on the media that you're looking at on the Xbox menu. But overall guys, this is how you set a custom background on your Xbox One. If you did enjoy the video, feel free to leave a like right down below and of course subscribe for more helpful ticks and ticks, tips and tricks like this. This has been Sam with iUpdateOS and I'll catch you guys in the next one.